coming out with the golden boy himself, Three, Roy. Two, one, go. Interesting. So we have yet to see Black Twins play Roy today, as far as I've seen. Um, so I, it's probably a matchup dependent. It's probably something he likes uh, specifically about playing against uh, Samus or more projectile-based characters rather than uh, pulling out the Lucina. So far, though, it looks like he's off to a great start. He's been racking up percent fairly easily. As uh, most of his hits seem to come out just as Advo is uh, trying to punish. Oh, is I be not going to connect? All right, Advo getting a combo of his own here. He's trying to keep Black Twins down, but as soon as he gets through that platform, he finds an up air into the back air and will close that stock out. Finds his way back to the uh, ledge there, but Advo answers with an up air to Zare. Finds 7% on that trade, gets another seven. Oh, <laughs> playing with fire there. Down tilt's trade, actually. Uh, Black Twins throws his out first, and then Advo's punish. Oh, the Nair just a little bit too far away, and uh, Neutral B will come out from uh, Advo, getting that kill. Only a 50% lead so far. Definitely doable for uh, either player right now. As jabs come out from Advo, trying to box Black Twins into the corner, but so far, unsuccessful. Black Twins keeping Advo up in the air with a pretty unrelenting barrage of sword swings. A lot of forward, back, and up airs coming out. Black Twins again going for the falling up air here, not finding uh, any follow up though. Side B, fourth hit, setting up for an edge guard, but tether back. Yep. Black Twins opting to uh, just let Advo recover rather than going to uh, fight off stage with. Roy's significantly less consistent recovery compared to uh, Samus, especially with her tether. Yep. Advo making it back from real low. A couple jabs coming in from Black Twins. Not wanting to get too Ivy, but trying to keep him a little honest there. Now uh, showing him that he can't always go that low and drop now that he's uh, threatened that space. Black Twins waits out the uh, neutral B, but doesn't quite wait out long. Oh, he got his shield broken. Charges the uh, neutral B a little bit and then gets an F smash kill. So now, Advo with the lead here, but sitting at 152, Black Twins definitely uh, not going to give up. Up here from Advo. Finds another grab. Advo kind of running away with this right now. Uppies into the bomb to... Oh! Again with the bomb set up, getting that tiny little knockup so he can't shield. And then the uh, neutral B coming straight through, killing him. I'd go taking that two stock, actually. After Black Twins, uh, the first half of that game was looking rather dominant. Or at least uh, advantaged. That's the secret to Advo's game. It's all in the water. Stop battle, Lord all right, so we see the swap to the Pichu here Three, in game two. two one, go. Oh, they didn't. They didn't pick the banger. We got. We got a. Uh, Regular Animal Crossing music. That was a real nice backer. They're getting about 13-14% uh, off of just the one hit. Yeah, so far Black Twins looks like uh, his Pichu's doing a good job at keeping Advo from being able to land. Now we're in essentially FD mode, so we'll see uh, 
how that changes things up, but the charge shot will hit. Now, Advo with a bit of a lead. And uh, with Pichu dying significantly sooner than a character as heavy as Dark Samus, we see now Advo pulling away with the first kill. But Blacktoon's trying to answer with one of his own. Not quite finding it yet. F-Tilt's coming out. The up tilt connects. The Zare on the platform. All right. No, not going to get the kill with the down B. Just racking up a little bit of that percent. Up smash whiffs. Black Twins looking hungry for the kill here, but Advo not giving it to him without a fight. And the up air. Not going to go for another. Ooh, the down tilt popping him off the top, and now three stocks to one right now here for Advo. Black Twins just seemingly unable to kill this Dark Samus. We saw that be a big issue in last game where he was sitting at about 152 against the Roy, and now he's here 132 against the Pichu, and Black Twins, okay, finding the kill there, but still quite a sizable deficit. Oh, keeping the string going. Finds another grab, has him on the top platform, but now the charge shot's just about ready. We've seen before uh, how Advo likes to leave his charge shot just a little bit less so that it's not glowing, and they're using it to great effect, kind of sneaking the strong hit in on Black Twins. f tilt comes out from Advo. Black Twins hops into the bomb. Gets a little bit of a scoop going into the forward air, but Advo tethers back to ledge. Black Twins looking for the kill here, but just can't find a good opening. Advo just seemingly picking the right options at the right time. The F smash though, punishing the up B, not quite getting the scoop he was looking for. The platform retreating as soon as Black Twins started considering it. Oh, the raw charge shot hits. Now, another one connects. 2-0 for Advo so far in this set. Black Twins opting to run it back. Let's see what music we get this time. Black Twins probably thinking character decision here. Dropping game one and two with Roy and Pichu now puts him in quite the uh, interesting situation. We have seen him play Lucina so far today. I have not seen his Marth, but they would play extremely similarly. So. Opting for the Lucina here in game three. So we'll see three different characters from Black Twins here. Advo up 2-0. So... Advo doing a good job so far of uh, keeping center stage and pressuring Black Twins to ledge already. Only 15 seconds in yet, he's already racked up 70%. Advo just seems to have like a flow charge just perfect for uh, how to keep sorties at the ledge. Oh, just a little bit too close there. Uh, Lucina managed to cross up with uh, the roll, getting behind for the uh, neutral beat to miss. Lucina finding the forward tilt. Oh, and the back air gonna kill from all the way across the stage. Advo taking the first stock yet again. Black Twins going deep. Oh, <laughs> very uh, scary movement there with a lot of rolls and raw dodges coming out from both players. 
So, just game three nerves. Down throw. Waiting to see what his options are. Oh, up air connects from Advo, leading into a grab and a little bit of a combo. Finds the back air as he's falling, but Black Twin swiping away a little bit. Still yet to take the first stock off Advo. Up air comes through, goes for a second, finds the Zare after. Again with these up airs. Advo not letting Black Twins take center easily, but as soon as he does, the charge shot allows Advo to make it back to the ledge. F tilt not going to kill from over there. Again, Advo just doing such a good job at holding on to these stocks. Up air connects. Will he go for a second? No. Opting for more of the Zair option. Finds the grab and goes for straight up throw, killing. Advo with full rage right now. Three stocks to one. Black Twins potentially dropping into losers after only one more stock. Forward throw. Black Twins setting up for the edge guard, but opts not to go for it. Finds the fair from ledge onto Advo. Advo recovering back with the up B, and that, that fair will swat him out of here. Two stocks to one in game three here. Couple combos starting off of a down throw from Black Twins. Advo finding his way in though with another forward air to the Zare after. Another Zare. It's been putting in a lot of work here for uh, for Advo. Blackswin seems to be kind of staying at that range where he's uh, in perfect uh, Zare position and yet cannot drift in with uh, an air or a fair. The back air still living though. Charge shot comes out. Up air into the back air from Black Twins. Going for the edge guard situation here. The F smash whiffs as uh, Advo air dodges back to the stage. Side B comes out a couple hits. Nair from Black Twins. Edge guard situation again, but Advo up B's to the ledge. Getting nervous here. Forward tilt not quite going to kill. Bombs being dropped though. Down smash not going to connect. Back throw from Black Twins. Drops low. One hit of up air connects, but no follow up. And the up tilt will do it. Advo taking it 3 0 after the probable favorite at this tournament, Black Twins.